This is a quick video, mostly for the guys that are down here close to Wilmington, North Carolina. I'm up at the tip of the Shell Island Resort off Wrightsville Beach, and this is the first time I've been here this season. It's uh, right before the end of February. And I am absolutely stunned with how the inlet has changed. The sand has come up, and a lot of the channels that used to be here that we would fish are now gone. I'll go ahead and pan around so you can see what I'm talking about. Starting from the ocean, you see it all looks normal. The channel looks normal, but now over there on Figure 8 Island, you can start to see the extent of the sandbar has grown considerably. This is a little bit after low tide. Tide is starting to come in right now. And now here's an amazing thing. When you look over here, there used to be a defined inlet that you could get through along that far shoreline all the way back up around Figure 8 Island. And now that's all sand. Moving more to the left, this is the main channel. And you can see from the color of the water how shallow it is right now. And here is the real startling thing. Look at how the island has grown. You can see the channel we used to fish right here. And that used to be nice and deep. It's all filled in. And it wraps around the sandbar. But now the sandbar itself extends out and fills in most of the channel. I doubt a large boat could get through here at low tide. <laughs> Pretty amazing what Mother Nature can do to your, your fishing environments. This is why uh, Dick and I are going to start doing our recons here in March. We don't anticipate catching anything, but with the water temperature rising, the air temperature rising, it'll be above the 120 uh, number that denotes safe kayak fishing. And we're skunk today, so <laughs> at least we got out. Beautiful day, nice recon. Comments? Take care.